to have the physics of the small, quantum mechanics, marry the physics of the large, general relativity, because they're occupying the same space, if you will. When you take quantum mechanics and apply it to aspects of the fabric of space on that scale, what you have is a gurgling of the fabric of space-time. In fact, it's been called a quantum foam. This gurgling is because quantum mechanics prevents you from knowing anything with precision about the system. So you can't say, here's a spot on that grid. That spot is this undulating, pulsing foam. And so now, when you look at this foam, applying the laws of quantum mechanics to it, you realize that this fabric is not limited to one zone or another. In fact, there's a region of the fabric that could hatch out an entire universe with a variations in the laws of physics simply because the conditions that would spawn the laws of physics had variation in them. And so the multiverse is not just some invention out of the ether. It flows out of an application of quantum mechanics to general relativity.